Hi guys, today I have something special for you. Yeah, if I tell you that there is a OS for Raspberry Pi to turn it into a security camera, actually there is a such OS called Motion Eye OS. So we will install that OS on Raspberry Pi and get the video footage over a Wi-Fi or LAN. So guys, let's do this. <laughs> So for this obviously we are gonna need few things, the very first is Raspberry Pi 3, then a micro SD card and a SD card reader and a camera module for Raspberry Pi 3, a USB cable for power and a LAN cable and guys all the buying links will be in description. So if you are buying from these links that will help my channel grow, click make sure that. So coming to the next. First you need to download few softwares and the very first is Motion Eye OS for Raspberry Pi 3 and all the software links will be in description as usual. So let's get the SD card and put it into the card reader and plug it into your PC. Then open the SD card formatter software and click format to format the SD card and after that open the itches software and drag drop the OS image and click flash and wait for few minutes then the motion IOS will be flashed to your SD card. Then take out the SD card and plug into your Raspberry Pi 3. Then slowly connect the camera cable into the camera connector of the Raspberry Pi 3. And please be careful because the camera connector is fragile. And after the plugging of camera, plug the LAN cable into your Raspberry Pi 3, then plug the LAN cable into your PC. Then connect the power cable to the Raspberry Pi 3 and let it boot for few seconds. Then in your PC in network section, you will see a unidentified LAN network. To get its IP, we need to give it internet access. So. I will share my current Wi-Fi internet access with this LAN. To do that, we need to go to Network and Sharing Center and click on the wireless networks. Then go to Properties and click on Sharing tab. Then click on Allow and select Local Area Network or Ethernet whatever the option is and hit OK. After few seconds, open command line prompt and type a command ARP-A to list all the interfaces and we will see the interface. The dynamic IP 192.168.137.105 shown is our IP. To verify that, that it, it's ours in the network and sharing section, click on the LAN network. Let's see the IP range and you can see it's 192.168.137 so it's the same it could vary according PC to PC so let's open the browser and type the IP 192.168.137 and .105 whatever your IP is just type it and you can see our motion eye OS page is loading sorry about the video output because my Pi is lying just on the desk anyways Let's quickly login into it, put the username as admin and leave the password field empty and login into it. Then we can change a few settings to get a better video output. So try that and you will get a better output. Now let's get rid of this LAN cable. To do that let's go to networks. Then Turn the wireless networks on and put the SSID and password of your wireless networks and hit apply to apply the settings and it will reboot. Now we need the IP again because it will be changed. So I will access my routers page as you can see the active clients we have our motion IOS IP here. Let's open this IP in the browser. And now we can see our motion IOS page is loaded up in browser or Wi-Fi. And now we will not need the LAN cable so you can remove that. And now you can see our wireless camera is running inside Pi. 
and streaming over the Wi-Fi. Since this page is hosted on a web server, we can get it from a browser. You can connect your phone to the same Wi-Fi and access the IP and you will get the video streaming in your phone also. So guys, I hope you like this video. So hit like, give me a share and don't forget to subscribe. And use the comment section to let me know your thoughts. And I will see you in the next video. Be drops out.